Hello, here's a quick tip of how you can quickly iterate on a key light for your character without having to manually rotate it around and see what type of angle looks best. So this is a nice little trick that you can build on as well in the future with uh, certain setups and customizations, but on the base level, what does it look like? So I've got a MetaHuman here from the MetaHuman startup scene. Uh, I've set my camera up in the viewport with a bookmark and I've got a light hitting this character. If we have a look here. So this is hitting the character. One light, got some nice catch light in the eyes as well. So uh, what is a trick you can do? So once you've set the, the distance of the light uh, and you wanna start testing out different lighting looks, you might be tempted to you know start rotating the light around like this. And you know, this isn't too bad starting out, but you're gonna have to rotate it, move, rotate it, move. And you might want to debug or almost thumbnail quite a lot of looks for your character lighting. So instead of moving the light manually and trying to rotate it around and find an angle for a portfolio shot, what I uh, like to do is I like to use this sphere trick. So what I like to do is uh, I'll show you is you make a sphere in Unreal uh, and you just position it around the head of the character. And then with your key light, you drag that key light into the sphere. And then once you've set your initial position up of this light, what you can do is you can go into your camera angle, hide the sphere, uh, grab the sphere, and then rotate. And because your sphere is kind of roughly in the place of the head, you can start to get some more dramatic looks to your character. You can start to like position the key light, not the key light, the catch light in these eyes here and go for a look where you are catching it uh, with the character. So you can go like super, like this super, super moody like this. Rotate it up, rotate it down. Uh, you can do this on your rim light as well. For your fill light, I don't usually do it on a fill light just because a fill light is gonna be like quite big and hitting everything at once usually for me. So yeah, that's a, a cool trick you can do. So just make a sphere and uh, rag it roughly where the character's head is. Drag in your light, and you could drag all three lights in here as well if you want, that's completely up to you. Go into your camera angle, and then uh, just start debugging the look you wanna go for. And then after that, you can polish up your lighting and anything you need to do. So that's just a quick way to debug some looks for your lighting. Hopefully this helps.